my name is Anthony Paharich. Welcome to Victor Churchill, a beautiful butcher shop here in, in Queen Street in Wallara that my father and myself own. Today's about secondary cuts and about discussing whether or not there's still a bargain left in the butcher's cabinet. And as you can see here in front of me, there's still plenty of bargains left. We've got some pork here. Now pork belly is one of those cuts that's really popular. Everybody knows about pork belly. Um, it's got that beautiful combination of fat and meat. So the belly of the pork is really popular, but there's other types of belly also that you can get from lamb and beef also. Um, so we've got the lamb breast here, or the lamb belly. Um, and this can be sort of slowly uh, roasted in your oven, uh, slowly braised. Uh, it's really, really beautiful. It's got that nice uh, connective tissue that goes through it. So when you braise it really slowly, that connective tissue breaks down and is um, really gelatinous and very, very soft to eat. What we've done here at the front is um, some lamb riblets. So from the belly, from the breast, but we've just cut them into little ribs um, and they're perfect for barbecuing. Really cheap and inexpensive, around $15 a kilo. We've got the equivalent in beef here in front of me, which is the belly of the beef or the brisket as we call it. Um, and we've rolled it up really nicely. So you can throw that in your oven um, at a really low temperature, 120, 140 degrees for a few hours. And that meat will really slowly start to roast away and braise away. Um, and it'll sort of fall away and be very, very um, tender to eat. So that's a wrap up of all the really great secondary cuts or bargains that you can chase down at your local butcher shop. They're all very, very delicious. Um, slowly braised, they've got heaps of flavour and really tender and I'd encourage you to go out there and, and try some.